Well, uh, hey guys, Mac here, and today I'm making another Minecraft episode, and I haven't made one of these in a while. Actually, I haven't recorded an episode in a really long time. It's been like a week, and um, that's the reason for that is because I recorded so many Little Planet episodes that I decided um, uh, there's I don't I I just didn't really feel like making an episode since I have so many of them lined up. So yeah, anyway. Um, today I have something planned. I want to make a pumpkin farm. As you can see, I have pumpkin seeds here. And I found a really cool way of making it. Well, not necessarily really cool. It's actually kind of cheap. And it's for poor people that don't have slime balls. And I am one of those people. So I'm going to get some materials here. I was just showing you kind of where I'm going to place it if you didn't see that. Oh, of course you saw it, but I mean, I just I ran past there for a second. But okay, um... I need cobblestone, not that one, this one, because I need to empty it out first. That should be enough. Actually, no, yes. Nah, me. Eh. Okay. So is there any in the furnace? No, okay, never mind. I need to go on an iron trip. Alright, so what I need is I need 15 pistons. Whoa, that was weird. Uh, 1.8.1 update came out. I'm, I don't know if it was already out already. What am I doing here? Sorry, I'm terrible at crafting on camera. This should make it to 25. There we go. And... Nope, doesn't. Alright, so... You guys can't see me now! Alright, um, I didn't want to show all that on camera. It wasn't really that bad, but um, eventually it just got uh, bad. Anyway, um, this is actually kind of going to be kind of a tutorial if I can do this on camera. So here we go! Alright, so this is going to be called a pumpkin crusher. Now, um, this is made, uh, the reason I'm making this is because it's made with, okay, I thought I saw the, thought I heard a zombie in there, I guess not. Um, this is made without any use of sticky pistons. It's going to be an automatic um, pumpkin farm. Thinking, I can place it here, but it's going to be ill-symmetrical, but I guess I'll just have to deal with it. So you got to dig out a 3x3 three three area. And you gotta dig out 15, but not starting from here. So there we go. Okay. So now I want. Do I want it? Oh, yeah. That that. Well, no. Since, well, yeah. Okay. They're all up. Sorry about that. All right. Um. So I want to do that. Um. Oh, there you are, buddy. There you go. All right. Bye now. Okay. So I'm just gonna make the doorway with andesite. So you use any block. Oh, actually, I'll just. So let's see if I can do this. I need a 3x3 three three area. There we go. Okay, so... Did I start my timer? You don't hear anything. Okay, so... You need to dig out 15 blocks. That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And then you need to dig out these two sides. Like so. And then, sorry, I'm talking a little weird, but okay, then you, um, put dirt. Oh, actually, dang it, you need to dig out more than this. So I guess, okay, don't take this as a tutorial then, because I'm going to mess up a lot, so just take this as me building something, I guess. Anyway, um, take that side, and then you just take the dirt, like, no, wait, hold on. Okay, I gotta think here. It's gotta be... I, I guess I can make it symmetrical, because it's gotta be one... Um, let's see here. It needs to be five wide. Five wide. So no, not symmetrical still. Let's see if I can make it symmetrical, actually. Let's see if I can make it five blocks. I mean, four blocks wide. So I'm just gonna dig out the rest of this. Um, I'm gonna put some torches here so it's not dark. Whoops, I didn't place that. Oh, well. Um, that was not delayed. I just... Well, it kind of was, but not audio-wise. Anyway, um... So, you're supposed to do, so what this is going to do is, um, it's just, since, uh, sticky pistons, usually, um, uh, you use sticky pistons for an automatic pumpkin farm, or not necessarily automatic, you just click a lever and they all pop up, if you've ever, uh, seen one of those, which you probably have, because they're pretty common, um, let's see, yeah, I have to make it five wide, darn it, um, I'm not gonna make it on the cactus side, so let's just do this. I can try to uh, patch this. I mean, um, what's it called? I can try to. You know what? Never mind. Um, so there we go. I just cut that because I don't want to show that anyway. Um, 
so now what it's going to be is um, whatever block type you choose all along the um, middle here and then and then um, the dirt so now you just place all this dirt here just delicious dirt I hope I have enough if not it's fine I can get more off camera I have a few stacks in my chest so okay this is a little dark still there we go and um, just place dirt all over on these two sides like I said it's not really a tutorial I'm just gonna commentate what I'm doing uh, during this so okay there we go and then so now I actually well I don't need to necessarily dig it out but what you need to do is you need to put I'm pretty sure yeah pistons go there so do that Take that out there we go so yeah I will have to do this so um yep this dirt was kinda useless but I'll place it back anyway so the, the idea is you place dirt there and then the pumpkins are gonna grow on the dirt and the pistons are gonna push down and the pumpkins will uh, be harvested so harvested is that the word yeah so I don't know anyway um and hence the term pumpkin crusher get it alright so okay now I need to place the pistons on this side and then I can replace the dirt so there we go and then I can start I don't know placing the dirt like so sorry guys I'm a little um off today I just it's actually kind of late at night and I haven't made an episode like I said in a week so the commentary might be a little bad also I didn't really commentate in my series of Living Planet because I wanted to focus on the gameplay instead of commentary so that's also another reason so I haven't done this in a while so anyway um so those are the pumpkins are the area where they're gonna be okay now you need to go one two right here in the middle and then one two um, every five pretty much or every four there okay so then you place your water I can do it there we go I'm pretty sure no I'm I mean yes I do have enough water but I thought it would be perfect but that's fine one extra and then after that you don't need this torch I mean you do but I can't place it there I think I'll place it here and here okay let's hope this work this works this might have to be above ground because when I um, tested this out I wanted to test to see if this actually worked in creative mode just so I don't mess up anything and the pump the things didn't grow when there were blocks around it and it had to be like in sunlight or something or yeah something like that did I really not bring a hoe that's ridiculous let me go get that um, which I should have one stored up in tools maybe I have a stone one from my beginning series I mean from the beginning yep I always make a full set of tools including a hoe right when I start out and I'm pretty sure I did do that okay, so now we can do this and um, this should all be um, look this should all look like that it should all be um, fertilized I think is it? no okay so because um it can go I mean the water should be placed correctly okay now I need the pumpkin seeds I can bone meal this because I have so much bones now from my uh, mob thing so I should be able to bone meal that. I don't have food on me, so I'm I might starve, but I mean I won't starve to death, but I might start getting hurt. After all, it is on hard mode, in which I should have done that at the beginning. Okay, so now finally you the redstone. I have exactly enough because this was kind of supposed to be a tutorial, but uh, it kind of failed. So all right, so I sh all all I need to do is dig out until the andesite stops showing. Otherwise known as 15 blocks, I could be counting, or I could just uh, do it this way, the way I'm doing it. Okay, there we go. And I can, whatever. So, this is exactly 15, so it won't need any repeaters. There we go. Right? Yep. Okay, I do not have wood. The, um, and then I'll place a uh, lever there, and the pumpkins will grow here, and the lever will be clicked, and you get yourself some harvested pumpkins so okay I'm gonna get the bone meal this is not all my bones I'm not gonna sit okay so here's my bones and see I have a stack more 
but I won't be needing it. It should take, actually I probably will, because it's like, it might take 90 bone meal, because usually these take 3 or 2, so, and there's 30 of all, so, I do math. I know math. Not really. Anyway, so just bone meal that to make this process quicker, and then I gotta test and see, okay, good test, good hypothesis, I mean my hypothesis is the fact that it works. This is when this is the part of the episode where I stop to make stop making sense and I most likely haven't been making sense the whole time. But anyway, yeah, like I said, a lot more bone meal. Probably not 90 per se, but I mean I need a lot more. Can I not run? Yes, I can. Speaking of running, I'm gonna need some food now. Now is the time to grab some. I have recently in the um, I'm pretty sure I said this already, but. When uh, I updated, I downgraded my world to um, turn it to one, uh, turn it to hard mode. I um, lost a whole stack of steak, along with tons of really good tools. I didn't really care, but I kind of cared about the steak because <laughs> it's my only food supply. So, but anyway, that is enough. There we go. Bone meal is set. I'll um, polish this up later. But the idea is, I still haven't gotten a stick. I had the perfect opportunity, and I didn't take it. Let me get real Actually, I don't even need to. There we go. Hi, look at that. Okay, so one cobblestone. Actually, a button might work even better, because I don't necessarily need a piston. So a button would work better, and a wooden one, too, so... Because a lever, I would have to click up and down, and then a button I can just click, and I can just run in there. So, uh, that'll be faster. Okay, here we go, and then I place that there. So now, there are the pumpkins, and you just, you would cover this up. So, you have to cover this up, actually. And I just did that. Well, hey, look at that. I had use for this bucket of water after all. Can I place it there? Yes, I can. And no, I did not place it there in the first place. I actually did lose the water source, if you didn't see that. Hopefully I didn't lose that one. I don't think so, because it was on the first. Um, oh, great. Okay, let me... Can I get this? I don't know. Can I? There we go. Right there. So the pumpkins won't go in the middle, and you can't not grab them. Oh, great. Here's how hard this is going to be to get around. Ah, uh, go under, go back up, this is the stupidest way to get around, but whatever, okay, and then I place the dirt back, alright, there we go, I finished, almost, you know, whatever, okay, so, that is the finished product, it will be polished up later, and so here's it, obviously, it brushes them, and you grab the pumpkins along the side here, for some reason they can't run, my running doesn't seem to work very easily right now. So, okay, um, grab the pumpkins. And there you go. So now I got an automatic pumpkin farm. I've been needing a pumpkin farm for a while, and I have it now. And it's not, I don't know if it's necessarily my design. I don't think I've invented this. Obviously, people did it. But this is just a cheap way of making an automatic pumpkin farm. And without the use, yeah, like I said, cheap. So without the use of slime balls. So that is the pumpkin crusher all right now what do I do um, all right so um I'm gonna end the episode here uh, I'm gonna end it, it's gonna be sh a little shorter than usual because I'm I'm just I'm off today so I'm just gonna just stop so anyway I finished up my uh, farm here, it's now polished and ready to go. I tried to make it look symmetrical. It didn't really work. I don't know what to do for it. So, I mean, the only, the only solution is to make this too thick and then move this to the side and stuff. But I don't really want to do that because it takes 15 redstone. It's a nice, cheap solution. It's a nice compact. So I don't, I don't really think I need to. So I'm just going to keep it the way it is. It's going to look a little weird, but it's not too horrible right good good so um, anyway it's working pretty well I can now get pumpkins and like I said pumpkins I mean before I did say pumpkins are useless but then I forgot I forgot about the best 
so I can make it a surprise. I'm not going to say it yet. The best food ever. I'm pretty sure it's this and either sugar or eggs. Let's go with eggs. Because that's obviously what it is. But my eggs seem to be either here or in the cake factory. And no, I don't think you can... Well, I guess you could make a pumpkin pie factory, in which I'm gonna do now! Ha <laughs> ha! Pumpkin pie. Yes, it's a very nice food source. And I think I'm gonna go with it. I've been eating carrots, and as you can see, I have a ton of them. Or I've been eating um, uh, chicken, which I'm out of. And then mutton's next, and then I was gonna eat my pork chop, then my steak, and then I was gonna be out of food. Now, I don't really want to kill my cows. I don't really want to take the time to kill the cows over and over again. I want to keep them. I want to milk them. I want to just keep them, I guess. And um, so, yeah, I'm just going to keep the animals the way they are. I'm probably never even going to come in there most of the time anymore because I already got my um, um, bookshelves ready to go. Um, I mean, I understand I'm probably going to need a lot more later in the future to make something big or something, but I'm just going to I don't know. I don't really care about them right now. But to the point is, I need food, and I got it now. So I didn't real I didn't realize that you can make pumpkin pie. I mean, I knew you could, but I forgot about it. And now that I remembered, I'm gonna use it. So anyway, also you can trade with farmers and get some emeralds off of that. Pumpkins 18 or something like that, and you get uh, emeralds. Or pumpkins in which I wanted a farmer that's I think I'm pretty sure I've said that before but um, yeah I wasn't lucky with the farmer and my f villagers don't seem to want to breed either so I don't know what's wrong with that I might have to move them to the surface which is gonna be annoying but I can manage it anyway I'm just rambling on right now you probably are bored because the gameplay is nothing got some iron but anyway so I'm gonna end it here I mean I guess I um, made some extra time with commentary. But, so, yeah. Uh, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Yes! Intro! The outro, I mean. Nice save. But now I ruined it.